Good morning, guys. Is there anybody more gorgeous than Miss Universe 2008, Diana Mendoza? Diana, good to see you. Please, we're going to talk Celebrity Apprentice. What a great season, but the ladies have been so unfair to Diana. We're going to talk all about it, and apparently there's a clip coming up on this week's show that's just going to knock your socks off. We're going to show you that coming up. 9 o'clock hour of the cage. Oh, not only is she stunning, you guys, but she's sweet, too. Diana Mendoza, Miss Universe 2008, is here. Good to see you, Diana. We're going to talk about Thank you so much. Celebrity Apprentice, yes. Donald Trump, all sorts of things coming up. And if you're a fan of Celebrity Apprentice, you're going to want to hear what Diana has to say about this coming episode. That's coming up. You know, speaking of the lottery, she won the genetic lottery. Well, <laughs> thank you. Let's you did too. Honest. You did too. Let's <laughs> be honest. You're so sweet. Let's she held the crown as Miss Universe 2008. <laughs> now she's holding it down on the new season of Celebrity Apprentice. Please welcome Diana Mendoza. Hi, guys. How are you? Hi, what, what country were you representing when you won it? Venezuela. Venezuela. Yes, I'm yeah. Venezuela. You sign off on that? Is that all right? Yeah. Is it, I won okay? that pool. Okay. Well, we were telling you. You won that pool. The Latin yeah. women have it on lockdown when it comes to it being Miss so. Universe. It's, it's, a, it's, a whole, it's a whole industry, I think, over there in Latin America. <laughs> we, we're very passionate about, about doing a great job, and, and, and it obviously works out very well. Yeah. What's it like? Yeah. What's it li Let's live in the world of Diana for a moment. What is oh. it like to be the most beautiful woman in the universe? <laughs> Listen, it's a, it's a great title, but it's a lot of work. You, you work, your, your platform is uh, HIV AIDS, uh -huh. so you travel around the world and it does make sense. You finally have a title and you can use it for well. Mm. Um, you give speeches and you go to hospitals and, and, and you show your support. Right. Um, and, and, and it's for a 20, 21, 22 year old, it's an amazing title, an amazing Absolutely. work, an amazing job to have traveling around the world and, and you know, can meeting Mr. You, Trump. And what, what age group of guys <laughs> tend to approach you? 45-year-old newscasters. No, I'm not talking about 45-year-old news. I'm, I'm, I'm yes. just curious because you're in your 20s, right? And so for guys in their 20s, it must be incredibly intimidating to come up to, to, Miss, up Universe to Miss Universe and say, yeah. hey, you want to go on a but date? She doesn't say, hi, I'm Miss Universe everywhere you go. When you go grocery shopping, you don't wear the crown in the of course thing. Not. Yeah, yeah of course she's not. just uh, Diana. But, but, right. No, but not obviously. Yes, the twenty, the twenty year olds are, are not are not as approachable <laughs> right away. But but some sometimes you can see one person ages. that is more courageous and right. will go. And, yeah. Are you dating, married? I'm dating. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Now, Mr. Trump, the Donald, was your boss when you were Miss Universe. Yes. Now you've gone back to the Trumpster yes. for Celebrity Does he hit Apprentice. On you, though? <laughs> never, never, oh, no. never. Really? You know, people will just assume it. Excuse me? Does he leer at you? Come on. I don't even know what that means. <laughs> it's probably best not to know. Let me Google that word. It's a good word to not know. Um, no, no, no. He's been extremely respectful with me and, yeah. and extremely helpful as well. I've been, I've been working uh, for Mr. Trump since the Miss Universe started. Right. Then I went to join me, uh, Trump Models right. now at the agency, the model agencies. And now, uh, I'm the Celebrity Apprentice, so. Okay, let's talk about Celebrity Oh, let's apprentice. dig in. Right. You, I have to say, have been so gracious and lovely through this whole thing. Your whole thing Thank is, you. look, this is for charity. Yeah. We're doing a nice thing here. Right. Meanwhile, the ladies are literally ripping mm. into you mm. every mm. single mm. week. It's, it's interesting to watch for, for me, and, and I'm sure for, for, for you guys it's very entertaining as well. But um, yes, that's the point. We're working for charity. There is no reason to be uh, offensive and, and, and start drama when it's not necessary. It, as long as we can do a great job and, and keep winning our task, then we'll be more successful at what we're doing. They, and that's they, not what's happening. So they're catty and mean to you? Or um, let's give you an, let's, can we okay. give Frank an example? Because we have the, a clip. Oh, well, then there you go. This, sure. will, this will tell <laughs> you everything will okay. you need to know. <clears throat> Celebrity Apprentice. Shut up. Shut up. Fine. Shut up. So don't, don't, don't stress. Oh, no, my God. Don't stress because all the responsibility is me. Why would you ever stress? Oh, I'm I sure Mr. Trump's not going to choose the winner. There's going to be shouting and yelling and screaming and crying. If we lose I'm and it's because Lisa. we don't have subway directions, then I'll go home. Lisa. Can the yapping never stop? I'm like blown away by the stupidity in parts of our group. I just sweated my ass off putting this book together. I am sick of this pressure from women who all they do is look in a mirror. You develop a talent and a brain, and then maybe the world will take you seriously. Wow. What? What? That's what? what? 
Well, there was some crying there too. Extremely she was entertaining <laughs> to watch. <laughs> what do you have? Well, how do you respond to that? That's just that's Listen, just mean. Listen, I mean that's that's. That's obviously her issues. I have nothing to do with, with yeah. what she's going through right there. Um, I'm working as hard as, as, as I can. And there's just so much you can do when people are not willing to work with you, you know? Um, again, I'm, I'm there doing my best and, and, and giving my suggestions and, and speaking up as much as I can, as much as they pre pretty much allow me. Uh, as you could see, it was all about shutting up with an ear, yeah. et cetera, et cetera. So putting you on a side is hard to, it's hard to work with people that definitely don't want to work don't with you. Hear you. Sure. And I feel like they treat you like, she's a pretty little thing, let's put her over here, she can yeah. only do this, and let's not, you know, bother her with, with the important stuff, and that... Be above it all. Yeah. <laughs> I, I really think it's, it's, easy for, it's, e it's easy for some people to deal with situations like that, doing it that way, when, when, when they have a, some sort of a strategy which is not as positive and as not as uh, honest when you're competing for charity. And um, again, probably the, 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 the idea would be to try to take people out somehow. Yeah. Um, mm. by not being uh, honest or, 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 or hmm. just following Have you values. been a team leader or group, what do they call it, the group, project the leader? Project yeah. manager. Yeah. 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 Have you done that yet? I, I did it, and, and yeah, and my team and I, we really did, I, we really did very well. We did an amazing group, amazing job. Um, we had a great, we had a great, um, a great project. We actually won $20,000 for the Latino Commission on AIDS. Way to go. Well, just Thank rise you. above it, stay the course. <clears throat> Yeah. Well, she is and above it. I mean, you're what, you know, like you're six like feet? Six, yeah. 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 Literally. You're literally above it. <laughs> literally. <laughs> no, literally. listen, I, I, get, I get what Lisa is doing. I, sh I get that she's, she's a comedian. Right. right. She's there also to try to squid some, some of that juice, you know, and, and get, get everybody to know that she, she's funny and that she can <laughs> cry and make people be, you know, more probably interested on her. But, um, but when she... got a good attitude. But yeah. when, she gets good attitude. To, when she gets to a full to a full culture, which is, she's, which is something that she's been doing lately uh, by calling words, then I think that just crosses the line. It goes over a line and that's not about laughing or, or performing right. on stage. That's, that's yeah. being just hurtful. Diana Mendoza, Celebrity Apprentice, Sunday nights, 9 p.m. on NBC. I can't wait to watch this week. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks oh so much, Diana. Thank really you guys for having me. All right, Thank let's you. talk weather, Mark. Weather is looking.